Hey guys, how's it going? So I'm actually recording this because I forgot to turn on with the um, external microphone, but I just want to give you all an update on what I've done. If you notice something different, yes, I went ahead and redid the um, direct drive extruder mod. I went ahead and made it uh, work. So it's, well, it's now facing you, the stepper motor is facing you. Um, the, the reason I've went ahead and done that is because I ordered some pancake, uh, well, just one pancake stepper driver for the extruder uh, to cut down on the weight. And also it's gonna be a lot nicer looking. It's gonna be all black. And um, probably gonna get that within the next two, maybe four weeks since I ordered it from AliExpress. So that's gonna take a bit of time, but we'll up to you once we have it. Now, given that said, uh, let me just show you what I'm kind of going for. Uh, because I'm still waiting for the blower fan for this one as well. So this thing's going to go right there. And then with the pancake motor, it's, it's, I think it's going to look very great. It's going to look a lot more, um, well, nicer than what it looks like right now. Plus, I'm also reprinting this mod. I already redid it. So Because I want to run those cables you see through there, uh, through, the, through the mod itself. But that is going to require me to fully disassemble the hot end uh, to run the wires through there. Cause of course, it's not going to fit because of the... Of the heat sink um this should print out uh, it should be done within the next two hours or so so i'll once it's done i'll probably get to installing it and uh, testing it out but um just to give you a quick um sneak preview on what it should look like give me a second all right so this is kind of a look i'm going for i'm not I'm not I'm not very good at modeling. I'm still very new to this. Never even modeled before this. So like, again, I'm learning uh, every day on um, doing this. So a lot of this is just remixes. I, I would never be able to make something like this shroud in a million years, probably. Uh, so this this is just a remix of the shroud, um, and it's um, race. It's going to be held in by magnets, as you guys saw in the previous video. What I did do, mainly myself at this point, is this direct drive mod to make it vertical. Um, it's not too hard. Um, the cool thing is that somebody actually made a uh, STL, oh, STL file or a 3D model of the carriage itself, which is great. Makes fitting everything super easy, very cool. So shout out to the guy who made this. Um, I'll link uh, these file, this file down below. This is not ready yet. I'm not. I'm not uploading this yet uh, since I'm not fully sure it's going to work. Uh, I still need to get the blower fan, which is still an order from AliExpress. So again, it should be here within the next two, maybe three weeks. And um, also, this is um, just a random pancake step promoter file I found and just imported it. And also, this dual gear extruder, which I imported it. I would never be able to design this. So uh, props to them for making this. So um, the main thing here is, is this. So um, I did, re I did um, have the one that's printed, but I'm actually redoing it. I made this part a lot wider because, again, I want to run the, the wiring through here. But again, I'm going to have to disassemble the entire hot end assembly and uh, fish the parts in there and then reassemble it. So it's not going to be as easy as the other direct drive mod, unless you want to just run the wires like I have it right now through the side. With, uh, just hold it, hold it in with a zip tie or something. So um, that's currently what I'm printing. And uh, again, I'll probably install within the next couple hours and see if everything works great. But um, but yeah, uh, tell me what you guys think. I think it looks pretty good myself, but I guess you guys will be the judge of that. Um, and again, the reason I'm not uploading this yet, uh, just to give you some quick background, uh, is because I tried to remix one before, which was this one right here. Um, this is how it would kind of look, right? So I was pretty confident it would work. I test fitted it, and I, I thought it, I thought it fit okay. But once I tried to actually use it, this would actually not make contact with the or or made it so it it wouldn't hit the X limit switch. So yeah, this was just poop and I actually uploaded it before I even tested it so I think a few people downloaded it and printed it out and just I just made them waste their time and filament so sorry again if you were one of those people who 
thought this would work. So um, first I'm gonna make sure this works, and then, well, I'll get them false on Thingiverse once I can confirm everything works, so you guys don't waste your time in filament. But yeah, let me know what you think. If you have any recommendations of what I can do next to this printer, if you uh, have done anything crazy, let me know. And um, once this is all done, yes, I, I will give everyone, I'll, I'll give you all a full tour, a full 360 degree tour of this printer once I have it fully done with this uh, direct drive mod in the new shroud. So yeah, let me know if you have any questions in the comments down below. If you're enjoying the content, then uh, please subscribe and uh, hit the like button if you can. Um, all right, I'll see what you guys have to say. Have a nice day. Peace out.